started on a two mile road march out here and it was raining heavily and then so first thing we started was fire and we went over all different types of fire making techniques from a simple bird's nest barrel rod to pick lighters um, and then from there Oh, duct tape, grill tuck tape, uh, birch bark, natural accelerants, birch bark, uh, fat wood, and pine resin. And then from there we moved on to char cloth, how to make char cloth, how to make punk wood. And then from there we moved on to uh, gathering water, where to look for it, how to gather it, how to treat it, how to dis disinfect it by boiling. We got water, we purified the water, and then... Um, he talked a little bit about the shelter for tonight, and then he showed us uh, like a, how to do a couple of different fires. We had a couple of challenges, which was a lot of fun. And then we did some stone boiling in the dry bag, heavy duty dry bag. And then we set up shelter. Well, the shelter was before uh, the water. So we set up the shelter, which is basic. Uh, space blanket shelter at a 45 degree angle, one step away from the long fire. And then uh, the last thing we did was make beds out of leaves and trash bags. We Whew. hiked in really fast, had to chug all our water, yeah, really fast. and then spent most the afternoon without water. We gathered wood mostly. Gathered wood. This thing, this space thing that took like 10 minutes. And, uh, now the guys are just having fun. For tonight. Nice. What was your experience level in the woods? None. Oh, none. Really? Zero. The first time. <laughs> nice. And how's how is this experience for you? Is it digestible? Is it? Oh, for yeah, me, it for is me, it is. Digestible. For me, it is. I think I think it has to do with um, personally not coming with any expectations and just being open, very open-minded. Nice. Uh, um, for me, it's more for inner growth because I know there are a lot of layers like. Before I had like fear of the dark or whatnot or being in the woods and the animals and so on. And this is just a, another step to move forward. So it's, it's a resemblance of whatever's coming up is a resemblance of what happens in real life. Yes, good. Okay. So, it's yeah. so I, too, you know. Yeah. I made a fire today for the first time. <laughs> for the first time? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Did you use a match or did you use a ferro rod or? Where did you start? We used a fair rod and we learned how to use the mini and sano, uh -huh. sano. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of good information that will help anybody that's out in the wilderness mm -hmm. without experience. Like I can, I know how to gather, um, what the heck is it called, tinder, mm -hmm. and how to kindle it and put fuel in it. And, um, I know the good use of a bandana. <laughs> charcoal and sun. So that is very educational that I never had before. So I can now, I can do those things for sure if I were to be out here. So it's very helpful for someone who doesn't know how to do these things to learn the basic skills, you know. Nice. Yeah, as far as the, the amount of information, for me it's personally, very it's very digestible. Yeah, very easy yeah. going. Yeah. I think we know how to set different fires with like the fire steel. Um, yeah, Jim did some demonstrations, boiling water, boiling water, char, char cloth, char cloth, yeah. and the punky wood char cloth, which I never had heard. Compared to last night when you arrived, would you say your comfort level in the woods is the same? No, it's oh, different. Nice. Way, Way different. different. Way different. Way <laughs> different. Yeah, I you're breaking her <laughs> slowly. <laughs> She's so, got mud on her shoes already. I yes. Know, I, I sat knees. on the floor before I, I had the yeah. I had a, this on my buttocks to protect me. But right. then I'm now sitting on it. So nice. It's definitely better. Yeah, she's doing great because she had a big, huge fear of, of the dark animals, oh, just the woods, everything. Oh. Yeah. And I think it's been all the good. I've been like. I like the fire I, when we first started making them. Yeah. Speaking or just boiling the water too. Yeah. How like it boiled like within a minute. Yeah. It had been pouring all morning and then it stopped and then we started working on fire, so probably that.
Nice. But the water was cool. It only took like 30 seconds. Yeah, so fast. So, very cool.